yeah. to express our condolences for the passing of your fair majesty. This is life, you know. It is a very sad day for, for the British people. I think we all feel very personally attached to the Queen. Uh, I've met the Queen myself several times and I serve formally as her ambassador, so it's a, a sad day for me personally. But we have been very moved by uh, how many Israelis, from the President and the Prime Minister to, to friends and neighbours who've expressed uh, sympathy and condolences and said how much the Queen meant to, to them as well. So that's at least something that gives us support at a difficult time. The, the royal family has a strong attachment to Israel. Uh, King Charles, as he now is, came to Israel um, two years ago uh, to the event at Yad Vashem and he received President Herzog uh, in Britain last year. So there's a strong link between Israel and the royal family and that will continue. You know, no doubt that Her Majesty has been an icon, international icon, you know, so uh, people uh, do have uh, respect uh, to her, you know, regardless if you agree, disagree on some of the uh, British policies, but uh, above all the United Kingdom uh, and Her Majesty and the royal family of the United Kingdom uh, has been uh, always, uh, especially uh, in the last uh, centuries, uh, uh, key players also in our region. So there is so, uh, a lot of respect, but also a lot of expectations. And we do hope that uh, there would be uh, more uh, role to play, as I said, in, in our region in promoting peace and justice among the various peoples in this area. Well, we feel sympathy to all British people those days when we are in war and Britain is one of the, our greatest supporters. And I do believe that the current Prime Minister, Liz Truss, would be even more support. But it happened to me to meet Her Majesty in person a few years ago when I was a member of the delegation in London. And uh, I could not express my deep regret of uh, this loss of all British people. She was always so graceful, she embodied a sense of duty perhaps like no one else I can think of um, and, uh, and she'll be sadly missed. She was uh, loved by the people of my country, by Australia, but by so many countries around the world.